Hey guys, I'm Slime Challenger, and did you notice what's different about me? I'll give you guys five seconds to guess. Five, four, three, two, one. It's my hair. Did you guess it? Well, if you did, good job. Last time, I had it really long, and I cut off this much. It is so much that I cut off. I had a parking lot haircut, so it was super hot and it might not be totally even, but it's super nice still. Now, enough about my hair. Let's get to the challenge. So today's challenge is going to be the three Elmer's activators challenge. And how this challenge works is I'm going to be mixing three different types of Elmer's activators together. They are going to be the crunchy slime activator, Confetti Slime Activator, and Magical Glow in the Dark Slime Activator. I'm going to be mixing these three into a clear slime. So I think we're ready to make the slime. So now that we have all of our ingredients, it's time to start adding them in. The first step is adding in your glue. I'm not going to add too much, about five ounces, because that's what you want. I think that's probably good. So, now I'm going to add in the activators, the best part. So, the first activator I'm going to pour in is the Glow in the Dark activator. And I'm only going to use one half teaspoon for each. And I'm going to make sure it's very precise. Ooh, it comes out so slowly, it's so cool. Okay, I think I'm gonna put that in. It looks so cool on the blue. Look guys, that is awesome. Now, I'm gonna move on to the next one. The next one I'm going to add in is the crunchy slime activator. And this one is so much lighter than the others. I don't know why. I think it's because it has all the foam balls, but wouldn't that just make it heavier? Because there's more in it. I don't know. I'm just gonna add it in. Adding it in. Hmm, it's kind of hard to get it out. Hmm. Why won't you come out? Mostly foam balls almost. Oh, maybe it's coming out. I think it might be coming out. <gasps> it's coming out. Look at that. So I guess you need to squeeze it. That's cool. I'm just gonna use my finger to get everything out of here. That's better. Okay. Now for the last one, we're going to be adding in the Confetti Magical Liquid. This one looks so bright and colorful, and I'm so excited to try this. So I'm going to just put it here. Oh. Guys, look at that. So awesome. It looks so colorful. It looks like a rainbow. I'm gonna get everything out. Now it's time to stir. Here you can see all of the activators. Isn't it so pretty? So now I'm going to stir it. And oh, it's so cool. I almost feel like it's gonna turn out super clear because I feel like it's like a lot more clear than color, but it's so beautiful. So I've been stirring it for a little while, and it looks like it needs a bit more activator. So since I want everything to be even, I'm going to add a tiny bit of each one. So now it's time to squeeze.
okay. So now they're in here and I'm just gonna put that in. Okay, now we're going to mix a bit more. It's looking so cool. I really hope it glows in the dark. Such a nice consistency. But it still needs a bit more activator, so I'm going to add a tiny bit more of each. Hmm, that was a lot. I'm going to put this. I think my favorite of the three activators is probably the confetti. It's so colorful and bright. Now back to stir. <laughs> that was a spill. Now it's coming together nicely. I'm going to put one hand in. It feels sticky, but not super sticky. Ooh. So cool. So I think I still need to add in a bit more activator. I'm going to be putting them on a spoon bowl in here. There. And a tiny bit of this one. And a bit of this. There. Now let's try to pour that in. getting better, but it's still sticky. I think I need to add in more still. Uh, when will this sign ever come together? It's pretty hard to add them all together, but if you have these three, you guys should definitely try it because it's super fun. really helps it a lot. Ooh, look at that, guys. It's turned into slime. Except it's still sticky, so I'm going to add more of it. 
more activator. So beautiful and pretty. Whoa. I love this slime. Get everything off of the spoon. When will this slime ever come together? It's slime, but it's super sticky. Hmm. <laughs> there. Let's see if that will work. Guys, I think that might have just done it. This feels so nice. It feels like a fluffy cloud. And it's super crunchy. This slime is so amazing and still a bit sticky, but I would definitely recommend you guys to try this out on your own. But also, make sure you add more than they tell you. They tell you to add, well, let's see. They tell you to add like one teaspoon worth of it and to start, I would think it's more like two teaspoons or three. This needed a lot of activator to get to a good consistency, but I still really love the slime. It pops so much, and all the activators are so cool. I'm so excited to try them on their own. So do you remember how we added in the glow-in-the-dark magical liquid? Well, now it's time to see if this slime can actually glow in the dark. We are going into my very, very dark bathroom and seeing if we can see the light. So come with me. So we are in my bathroom and now we are going to see if this slime can really glow in the dark. Whoa, it is glowing so much. I did not think it was going to glow this much. I thought it would be so little of a glow. It's so bright, I love it. Today's challenge was amazing. I'm so happy it worked I'm out. I'm so happy I got these activators because they are so good. And I love this slime so much. What do you think I should name it? Hmm. Well, anyways, that was the end of today's video. If you liked it, please subscribe and turn on notifications. Also, click that thumbs up and watch my next video. Also, have a great day. Bye!